Hello, in this video we're going to be looking at how to use Zoom to schedule meetings in Canvas. By the end of this session, you'll be able to schedule a Zoom meeting in Canvas. Let's go into our Canvas dashboard. Now there are two ways that you can schedule meetings so that students can access your Zoom room. You can schedule meetings from within Canvas and you can also schedule meetings from the Zoom portal. I'm going to show you both ways but we're going to start from uh, one of the Canvas courses. I'm going to go into my test course and here you will see that Zoom meetings is now an option in your course navigation menu and Meets is also an option. So Meets is the WebEx integration into Canvas and so in order to avoid confusion for your students, we would recommend that you hide the one that you're not going to use. So if you're going to use Zoom, then get your Meets link out of the course navigation menu. So you would go to settings, you would go to the navigation tab, you would click on Meets, and then you would drag it to the bottom half of the page where this item will now be hidden from your students. I've got Zoom meetings close to the top so that it's easy for students to find. And once you've made those changes, you would hit save. And if you go back to your home page, uh, you'll see that the course navigation menu has now changed. So we're going to go to Zoom meetings and we're going to schedule a meeting from here. And the nice thing about Zoom, which is different to WebEx, is that Zoom meetings actually do show up on your Canvas course calendar. So once you click Zoom, you would schedule a meeting. You would add your meeting details in on this page. So here are my details. First Zoom meeting in Tony's test course, adding a Zoom meeting from within Canvas. I've set the date for the 10th of August at four o'clock. It's going to last for one hour. This is a one-off meeting, so I'm not going to set it as a recurring meeting. I'm going to enable the waiting room. I'm going to make sure that the host video is on and participant videos are off when they enter the room and they can choose to turn them on when they enter. I'm going to mute participants upon entry and I'm going to hit save. And then you come to this page that looks like this. Here you get an invitation link that you can share with guests who are not part of your Canvas course. You can sync this meeting with your Outlook calendar. So if you press this Outlook calendar, you get a meeting invitation that looks like this. So you can see first Zoom meeting in Tony's test course happening on August the 10th from four until five. I can save and close and then that meeting will be added to my Outlook calendar. So once I've done this, I can go to my Zoom meetings and I will see that that meeting now is listed. So it's for today at four, it's called the first Zoom meeting in Tony's test course. And because I I um, scheduled the meeting, I can start the meeting from here. I'm going to show you what it looks like in the calendar. So here I am in Tony's test course. And you can see that for August the 10th at four o'clock, we've got the first Zoom meeting in Tony's test course. And students can join the meeting from the course calendar. So if they click on this meeting, they are given the information to join the Zoom meeting. And they just click here and they can join the meeting. Alternatively. If you keep your Zoom meetings link visible to students and you want them to join the Zoom meeting from this link, what happens when you go into student view, you'll be able to see what the students will see. So here I am, I just selected student view. I went in back into Zoom meetings. You can tell we're in student view because we have this bright pink border and the button that the students will see will say join whereas yours will say start. So once you create your meeting within Canvas, students can access it through the Zoom meetings link. They can access it through the global calendar. And you can access it either from the calendar, from the Zoom meetings link or from the Zoom portal. So now that I'm in my Zoom portal, I go to my meetings link and I can see all the upcoming meetings. And so this is the one that I created within Canvas and it shows up in my Zoom portal. And it's called first Zoom meeting in Tony's test course. I have a meeting ID and I can start the meeting from here too. 
If you would prefer to create all of your meetings from your portal, you can do that and then you can import them into Canvas, into the course. So that's what I'm going to show you next. So here I'm going to schedule a meeting and I'm going to call this one the second Zoom meeting in Tony's test course and the description is creating a meeting in the Zoom portal and adding it to Canvas. I've set it for the 11th of August from four o'clock for one hour. I'm going to enable the waiting room. I'm going to hit save. And you get all this meeting information. So as, as we've seen before, you can add it to your Outlook calendar. You have an invitation link. But what we need to sync this meeting into the appropriate Canvas course is we need this meeting ID. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this meeting ID. I'm going to copy it. I'm going to go back to my Zoom meeting. So I'm in my test course. I'm in my Zoom meetings link. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to import the meeting that I created in the portal into my Canvas course. So I go to these three dots at the end of this row here. So after schedule a new meeting, we have these more options. I'm going to click on those. I'm going to say import meeting. And this is where I copy and paste that meeting ID that I had from the portal. And I'm going to say import. And so here's my first meet, my first Zoom meeting that we created from within Canvas. Here's my second Zoom meeting that I created from the portal. And so if we take a look at the calendar, we should be able to see both of these meetings. And so here I am in Tony's test course, to Tony's test course. And this was the meeting that I created from within Canvas. This was the meeting that I created from the Zoom portal. So you can do it either way and you can make sure that they show up in the right place by copying that meeting ID. So what we've looked at today is we've looked at how the two different ways that you can schedule a Zoom meeting within Canvas. So we looked at scheduling your meeting through Zoom within Canvas and then scheduling your meeting through the portal. So you have several options available to you and how you can schedule meetings using Zoom in Canvas. Thank you for joining me.